the streets. We work it. Working this at exclusively on Streets 94. Fa- holidays, holidays, holiday season. So what happens when your album gets pushed back with no date? What What is it that you do? You it's have- called being shelved. <laughs> yeah, you need a hit. Well, apparently when that happens for Chris Brown, you start a new company. And he has made the announcement on social media of his new modeling agency called Legendary Faces. He tweet about it. He has a little logo and everything. So he's ready. Oh, yeah, I got to put sticks in there. <laughs> I, I bet he is ready. <laughs> I bet he's ready. Well, I'm sure he has a fleet. <laughs> yeah. But there is no word as to whether Karuchi will be one of those leading ladies. So they call it a modeling agency <laughs> now. That's what we call it. All right, cool. I'm going to start being one. Right. <laughs> Six put me onto this little tidbit of information yesterday, but now it's official. Jay-Z and Kanye West will be kicking off the South by Southwest concert, okay? Oh, them tickets about to go up? Uh, wow. Yeah, right. Uh, Samsung is doing it exclusively, and they also broke the news. The way that you can get to the concert is you have to have wristbands, but they'll only be available uh, to Galaxy owners who download the Milk app on their devices so if you don't have a galaxy and you don't have that app you're probably not going to see Sounds the complicated. Yeah, it it sounds, does. It sounds super sounds compli- difficult. complicated. All right. And you know, Jay-Z hasn't performed there since 2012 so I, it'll be a little bit of a treat. All right. Sierra, she's going shopping for her baby recently. Yeah. That was she supposed to do, right? Yeah, but this is an unusual purchase. She spent $20,000 yeah, on stuffed animals <laughs> in Los <Dang>. Angeles. <laughs> One of that includes a eighteen hundred dollar giraffe, an eight foot giraffe. That's that's yeah, doing too much. Like you're doing that for us now. You're not doing that for right. the baby because the baby does not care about that <laughs> at all. An eight foot giraffe. Just think how tall that is. Eighteen hundred dollars. Yeah. But it's the first one. You always kind of waste money on the first. You gotta one. overdo it. You know what I mean? All right, little Boosie. You know we're still talking about him and all the stuff he has going on. Now he's saying that he has a book and a movie coming out, Uh-oh. and he's also doing a collaboration with LRG. Him and Boosie. Badass Entertainment They're I've teaming up coming. together Yeah It's Shout pretty cool LRG. They're having a combination Of long sleeve shirts And custom letterman jackets But the jackets Will only for the be, be for the people That's in his camp So Y'all can't get those But you can get the shirts They'll be available Wednesday At 12pm Eastern Standard Time On shoplrg.com Alright Coming up next Atlanta's own Magic City has decided They're gonna sue somebody And I have who that is Coming up next Holiday season live Streets 94.5 some interesting news from bow, Magic bow, City. Bow, bow. We were just talking about this and them being tied up in a lawsuit. Mm. Well, there's a club in Chicago who jacked their name. Their name is also Magic City. Okay. Mm. Yes. And unfortunately for them, Magic City owns the namesake Magic City. So this club that's been open, Magic City decided that they're going to file a last lawsuit claiming the namesake and that the also the club in Chicago is insinuating that they are connected. Is it a not. club with dancers or yes, is it a club? A, it's a strip club. Oh, okay. Cool. I've been to it. it oh. Have you? Yes. Yes, it's, it's a strip club. Is it a magical place like the one here? Uh, yeah. <laughs> so okay. it's pretty. So it's pretty right. good. So I it's mean, not making the name look bad. You, what you just said about them being connected, they told us that when we went to the venue. It was like, yeah, we, we rock with the people in Atlanta. So See, that's crazy. That. And they're Uh-oh. saying that's absolutely not true. Now, I know everybody's wondering how much they're probably suing for. There's not a dollar amount per se, but they are trying to get the place shut down just entirely as opposed Little to... magic, what up? <laughs> dollar right, amount. Man. Because they're claiming it cheapens the original brand, Magic City, and it confuses the consumer. So I doubt people ooh, in Chicago I, own as much I, money yeah. as us. <laughs> well, I doubt people in Chicago think they're in Atlanta. <laughs> so, yeah. I mean, I'm sure they know there's a <laughs> separation you know, there. We went, we went by here yesterday. Oh, you yeah. know what's funny? It's right across the street from the bus station, and these guys that got off the bus, I'm assuming they're like, oh, welcome to the land of milk and honey, <laughs> Atlanta, and they were taking pictures of Magic uh, they so. do. Come on, man. You don't <laughs> yeah. be petty, man. Nobody ain't worried. Well, you good, bro. I'll keep we you, legends. I'll keep you guys posted if there's any updates on that lawsuit. Also, up on streets 945ATL.com, the exclusive interview with Ashanti and Holiday Season Live. Oh, yeah. And Holly got her to talk about Nelly. I did. So you definitely want to log on streets 945 ATL. on y'all ass. <laughs> so you can see what she had to say about Nelly. That's what's up, man. Streets 945 Atlanta's new hip-hop station, A-Town. Keep it locked right here. Twitter take over coming up next. Holidays, holidays, holiday season.